chase a bitch. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Taylor B Beauty, and this video is going to be a huge Sephora haul. So let's just jump right into it. My birthday was about two weeks ago, and I balled out for my birthday, and a lot of it was from gift cards because people know that I love, love, love makeup. So everybody got me Sephora gift cards and Ulta gift cards and stuff like that. So I'm just going to let you guys know everything that I got. Everything was purchased from Sephora or Ulta. So first of all, most excited about this is the new Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit that is in collaboration with Nicole Guerrero. I'm super excited about this. I used this in my makeup today. The highlighters in this palette are super pigmented and super buttery and smooth. I absolutely love it so far and I suggest you guys pick it up because it is limited edition. Uh, the Anastasia Lip Palette and I know it came out a couple weeks ago, maybe even longer than that, but I was kind of on the edge about getting it because I'm not creative well I guess I'm kind of creative but I'm just not gonna come up with lip colors all by myself like I want the lip color to be already pre-made and I've seen a lot of people like create colors using this palette and I'm like I'm not gonna be able to come up with the same colors as these people is gonna be, come, gonna be able to come up with but I decided to say hey why not use my creativity and I also seen people use them as eyeliners and well just eyeliner eyeliners and lipsticks and stuff like that and I also saw someone wear it in person and it was super matte when you think of a lip when I think of a lipstick palette I think of creamy lipsticks and that's just not me I'm not that person so when I saw the girl wear it I asked her what color she was wearing and I thought it was like a matte liquid lipstick and it was a creation that she created using the lip palette so I decided to get it I haven't used it yet but I will do a review video on it up uh, to Murad uh, face washes because my skin isn't really terrible but I'm trying to keep it I'm trying to get rid of dark marks I'm trying to keep my like random pimples at a at bay so I picked up the Murad clarifying cleanser I picked up the clarifying cleanser because my friend Brianna uh, showed me her before and after pictures of her acne scars and marks and how from about six months ago to now it's completely cleared up and her skin looks bomb so I picked up the clarifying cleanser and then I also want to get rid of my dark marks so I picked up the AHA and BHA exfoliating cleanser which gets rid of dark marks so I picked up these two things and I'll let you guys know how they work in the coming weeks of the Tarte Man Eater palette from Ulta it is limited edition and I think that it was only available at Ulta I saw it at the little checkout at the checkout counter and I loved it. So I used it. I didn't use it today. In along with my Stila uh, liquid eyeshadow, which is another goodie that I picked up, and it is this the Stila Rose Gold Retro Liquid Eyeshadow. I have it on my eyes today, and it is super super cute. I picked up a bunch of highlighters and lipsticks. So I also picked up the new release of the Estee Lauder Heat Wave. Like how pretty is this highlighter? It's a pure gold. I'm going to swatch it. Oh, so pretty. So, so pretty. You can see it right here. I love it. The Dior Nude Air Luminizer in the color number one. And this thing was a pretty penny, so... That was my own personal birthday gift to myself. And I really fell in love with it when I saw it swatched. Next, I picked up five sheet masks from Sephora. I have the Honey Mask, the Pearl Mask, the Rose Mask, the Green Tea Face Mask, and the Agave Face Mask. So I'm hoping that these work really good and get my skin together. For lip goodies, I picked up the Sephora Lip Cream in Pink Tea, which is number 40. I picked up the Smashbox Always On Liquid Lipstick in the color Stepping Out. And I picked up two 
bare mineral lipsticks which are new the gen nude matte lip colors i picked up boss and the two s's are dollar signs so you know i had to pick that one up and juju the nars soft matte complete concealer in ginger and i have the nars radiant creamy concealer in ginger as well wasn't really feeling it i didn't think enough product came out when you pulled it out of the tube and it wasn't really pigmented and i realized that i just like thicker con creamy concealers to conceal my dark circles i also got the mac lip scrub i got this from macy's this is my one goodie from macy's but i got this mac lip scrub in in candy nectar and i love it before i go to bed i just use it wash my face use that and pop right in the bed and my last two things that i got from ulta are the mario this is a repurchase but i got the mario badescu facial spray in aloe and rose water and i don't know i don't know if i've really seen it like i've used a whole full bottle of it and i don't know if i've really seen a difference in my skin i just feel good about myself spraying it on my face at night when i mix it with my moisturizer and last but not least i've never seen this before so i had to get it is the nyx beauty blender it's a lot of stuff from my favorite favorite stores and i'll let you guys know how much i like them and don't like them as time unfolds so everyone that is it i hope you enjoyed this sephora and ulta makeup haul please be sure to comment like subscribe and share this video and i'll see you guys later